Now, fortunately, the Apollo astronauts first landed on the moon July 20th, 1969, but actually the entire Apollo stack, all the way from the launch vehicle to the lunar module, the descent stage, the ascent stage was so complicated and almost impossible to fully test on Earth that a lot of engineers were really worried about a catastrophic accident on the first landing attempt. So today I'd like to go over the big picture issues in everyone's mind as to what could have gone wrong. So when astronauts landed on the moon, the entire structure sat, settled down on the moon there. The engine that landed them, the thrusted as they landed, is right there at the bottom. But actually, when they took off, they did not use this engine. This entire upper part of the craft off of the picture separated with another engine, which is inside of it. And that ascent engine is what actually boosted them up into space. Here's a better shot of the entire craft. This entire top part separated with another engine that's hidden inside. And that engine, the big primary concern is that if it malfunctioned either uh, in its guidance or if it actually exploded or had too little thrust or not enough thrust and it could not have been tested on the way down to the surface, if it didn't light at all or if it exploded, the astronauts would be totally stranded on the moon and there's no backup engine and no other way to get up into orbit to come home. Another issue people really worried about is that descent stage where they landed on the surface there. You might know that Apollo 11 got really, really low on fuel when Armstrong set it down on the surface, avoiding some last minute boulders and craters. One of the big concerns is if they depleted fuel and kind of fell even just a few feet uh, onto the lunar surface, they might have damaged the, the landing struts, bent the craft in such a way that they would not be able to take off again. You know, from the maps they had ahead of time from probes, they tried to land in a smooth region. But even in a smooth region, there's rocks everywhere, there's little depressions everywhere. So another thing they were worried about is landing the ship into a crater tilted in such a way that it would make it really difficult to take off safely. They were also worried about any kind of joints in the way that they sealed properly. The spacesuits had lots of joints and the airlock in the ship had lots of joints and the lunar dust is very abrasive and can damage seals. So they were wor really worried about uh, the integrity of the pressure vessel the whole time they were on the surface. Now the astronauts did not have any kind of cyanide capsules or anything like that. So if something went wrong, the plan was for them to say their goodbyes perish on the moon and for Michael Collins to come home by himself. He called that his secret terror. Learn anything at mathandscience.com.